Confetti, the son of Conair, topped the Steiner auctions when he was three and made it to the finals of the best European horses in Lanaken when he was five. However, after that he had to be stopped because of very serious degenerative arthritis in his distal interphalangeal foot joint. These x-rays taken when he was seven made the vets suspect the after effects of an infection in the joint. Confetti ended up being sold to have a horse trader, Giorgione, who called me after having tried to treat his lameness for over a year to no avail. He asked me if I could do something for this horse. I must admit that when I saw the video of this poor, very lame horse in spite of the anti-inflammatory therapy that was being administered, I was not sure I should take the case. However, the extreme beauty of the horse and the possibility of developing a protocol to treat foot diseases in horses pushed me to try. He arrived home and the challenge began. I injected stem cells in the joint, tendon sheath, collateral ligaments by local perfusion and intravenously every two months. His improvement was very gradual and at times I thought it was a hopeless case, but I continued the therapy until one day. After eight months, something happened and confetti became sound. He took part in some competitions and had a relapse, but it didn't last long since with the passing of time I got better and better at tailoring the therapy and getting better results. After confetti arrived, he remained thin despite being put out to the grass. He couldn't put on weight because of the pain. Here you can see him a year later. He is as a fit as a lion. This story proves that stem cells have succeeded in curing degenerative arthritis a disease so far considered as incurable. Here is Confetti at nine, at an international competition in Follonica. He is being launched and he is perfectly sound. Here is Confetti trotting at the international competition in Follonica after a lesson with Giorgio Robbiani. Now he is sound takes part in international competitions where he is vetted before he is allowed to compete and gives my daughter Antonia one clear round after another. But most of all he has allowed me to develop an effective protocol for foot and navicular disease in horses, as you will see when I tell you the story of the grey horse.